Now at six, making a decision on the right college is a big commitment, but some students are hesitant after the pandemic changed how college will look. 10 TV's Krista Frost talked with a student who made a choice she describes as flexible. We used to live on OSU campus, and that's like kind of the biggest reason why I wanted to go OSU. I just not for the parties, but I just thought a campus was cool. Many students wanting that same feel off to a college campus with others your age. Sally Brackbill was set on Columbus State, but that doesn't mean she wasn't considering Otterbein or Ohio State. I did. I got accepted into both. Um, and I actually got a huge scholarship for Otterbein. I got the president's scholarship, which is like like half or just under or just over half tuition. But it still wasn't enough. She and her parents wanted something affordable, and with most colleges moving online, Columbus State was the right fit for her. A lot of college students are making the same decision. Our uh, summer enrollment was up over 10%. Columbus State Community College President Dr. David Harrison says a good handful of those students got on board last minute. He expects that to continue. Brackbill says her friends might fall into that category. This is such a, I don't know, they feel like it's a big commitment, like four years of going to school. In Columbus, Krista Frost, 10 TV News. Ohio State sent us the breakdown of tuition for those going to in-person classes versus online. There's a roughly $200 difference between the two options for Ohio students. For out-of-state students, it's a nearly $10,000 difference between in-person and online tuition and fees.